Hello again. So this is the arena slash amphitheater that uh, I started to build before and was talking about. Uh, let me go in here and I'll kind of show you what it can do. So sorry about things being jerky. I don't know what's going on with my computer. I think it's Bandicamp. Uh, the recording software just doesn't seem to work as well as Fraps does. At least that's my opinion. But uh, it's not done. I'm still going to have probably two more rows of like seating and then there'll probably be like a stairwell in the middle of each section to allow for you to get to different levels without having to jump and then i've got these signs up here so you can open the gates so like uh you click on that and the gate over there on the oh <laughs> forgot that's the one down here so this gate down here this one opens that one over there and then it's got a delay because originally it was just a button. But so when I close it, you can see it takes a while before it closes. But I had that it set up as a button. So when you hit the button, it just opens the door for like five seconds or so. But the thing I want to show you, and I mentioned before that this is going to be an arena and an amphitheater. So when it's down, it's in arena form. And then when you flip the switch, stage rises up, bleachers come out. So you've got this sort of, you know, people could sit here and watch. And I'm not so sure I really like it. So what I'm hoping is to get your guys' opinions on this. Uh, whether or not you think this is something that I should just get rid of because it's stupid. I'm kind of leaning towards the stupid because... Part of me is like, okay, it's cool that it transforms, and I was all excited about it before, but having something that takes up this much space in the town, having something where, you know, people don't perform plays in Minecraft, if the king was to come over here to tell people, hey, what's going on, more than likely public announcements would be done over here, you know, on like in the main square or from the keep or something so it kind of seems silly that it would be way over here in the corner so we really don't see that portion ever getting used and if there were enough people to need that much additional seating you know i just i just don't see it so i'm kind of thinking that i want to blow it away not to mention let me just show you real quick what's down here this is oops this is the craziness that i had to go through to to do the wiring i mean there's like the middle row has to have these on to power them and then this gets power to kill those and then these ones are powered by i can't even jump now okay so these ones are powered by that which pops those up and then this row is powered back here which pops that up and then the far row there's there's one row that you can't see that's above this that comes out of the side and then you know each one of these for pushing the the lower benches out and then back over here I'm not going to really show you that well how this is done because it's, I'm not very good with redstone wiring and I think there's probably a much easier way to do this but I've got these set up to where all these get power which well Currently these are off, so these are on, which pushes both sets of these out. Then when this, these get powered, these all turn off, so those will retract. And I really don't need the bottom row to stick out. I just have them there so the very end one looks um, solid instead of having an opening where the pistons are. But I wanted this to be like the area where the training for the gladiators would go and maybe cages for like zombies and skeletons and things like that but it's so full i mean the area i'm in currently is big enough to put some of that stuff in but just all that redstone wiring just takes up so much space and it's just kind of almost silly so let me know what you think as far as whether or not that's just ridiculous and i should just get rid of it which is what I'm leaning towards anyway. But I mean, if you guys think it's really cool, then you know maybe I'll keep it. But I just, I mean, I, I like the concept. I just don't think it's working. And come on, let me fly, band game. But 
you know, my other thought that I might do uh, instead was to keep the same size arena, maybe just shrink it up by like one more thing and, and make it kind of like the fighting training area for guards and just build like a barracks and then have the area in the center where they would do their sparring and stuff like that. And, and that way, you know, if people can spar on it and we could have like a thing that releases skeletons or something like that. I don't know, but that's pretty much all I wanted to show you. Uh, I'm thinking about now showing you the build of the arches. So if you want to see that, you can see that real quick. Stick around. Otherwise, um, that's pretty much all I had to say. So, yeah, that's all I want to talk about. So, see ya if you're done. If you want to watch me build arches, then just keep watching and I will build arches. Uh, I may speed this up, so I may be mumbling to myself and not, you guys don't hear anything. But, uh, Still going to do commentary in case I don't speed this up because I probably won't. I think it's going to go pretty quick, so I probably won't have to speed it up. But I think that's the height that I want to go with. I could go higher because these are going to be brick up here, I believe, I want to do. It's hard to say because, like, I'm not exactly sure how I want this to look. Because this almost seems too wide to me. Oops. It's like if I stick this like so. Is that too wide of an arch? Let's see, let me go back here and Let's see, that's going to go all the way to there. And And because like a normal Coliseum, you'd have really wide passageways because there'd be a lot of foot traffic. And I th think this is going to be set up in such a way to where, you know, this is, oops, that's going to be like so, but I may put, hmm, I may do like an arch here as well to get in and out. Not sure. Not sure how I want to do that. I think figuring out this corner is probably going to be what's. So let's see. If we put one more in the middle, that'd be three, and then three. Let's try that. Oh, <laughs> I think I'm breaking something. I left it hollow back there. I'm not sure I need to, but I left it hollow back there just in case there was some sort of thing I wanted to add. Let's see if I do from... Let's try this. Let's go from here. Let's see if I have that. Let me go to there. Need this, this. Is that right? Boy, I don't know. That's 
too many, so I need to go track two. And then we'll try stacking two and see what that does. Okay, let's see. Well, I already see something I don't like because I went too far. So we'll break that, 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 break that. those and then we'll break all these out and then we should be able to put like some light so if I stack this one let's see how would I do that Go from there to there. And then I want this to have I know I didn't do this on the other side, but I think I should have. Okay, so if I do that, I think I need one more. That's, that's four. This is going to only be three. Hmm. things up just know it let's see cause so these would have to be single That I do not like. So how could we do this? If we made those four? Hmm. Four or five apart. Let's see if I did two more. That almost need like six if that was the case. Let's see if I did more. widen this middle one by two. So one on either side and then push all that over. Let's try that. Let's try that. So what I'm doing now is just going to move that, that way one and then I'm going to fill this back in and then move that over one then this should be part of Let's 
see if I move that one. That will give me a little bit different entranceway right here. Do I like that? I don't know. See, now I almost feel like these should be the the sandstone again. Uh, let's do that again, but this time I'll put the extra slash that never seems to want to appear anymore. I do you like how you can just push up and it picks it? That's pretty slick. Okay, so we'll make that brick. That brick. Does that look okay? Yeah. I think that looks okay. So, got a big arch here. That obviously needs to be upgraded with something. So then the next one... We will do two. Go from here to here. And get rid of the weather. Stack one. And that puts me right back there, but it's two, and I want this to be five. So we will expand. One, then stack one again, and that should I'm not sure if I like that or not. No, I think I'm going to go one more. You know what? Instead of doing it this way, I'm just going to go up here and hit U. And say move one and then you move one stack one that looks okay. to do that. Stick that there. Upper level. Okay, I'm liking the way this looks. So if we go from here to here, Stand up against this one and do a copy. And then that way 
I should be able to get right here and say paste. And that should give us a perfect placement of that. Okay, then we just gotta get rid of this end one now. Yeah, now it seems like, you know, they have something to get into. So let's see what that looks like. So that would be... Yeah, now the problem is... Is I'm going to have another row... Of these... Right here. Come on, you can do it, computer. That's weird. But, uh, you know, if I go all the way back with that, hmm, the more I do this, the less I like it. I just don't think you can make a proper Coliseum at this small of a scale, because I'm going to have to come out here at least, you know, probably will end up being all the way out here. So when I have these up, you know, to where the height is for the top of the bleachers, then you have your wall with an arch, you know, and then you've got this kind of a thing going on. So this goes down like so, and then that's going to be the outer wall of the whole place, which you can see over here, there's not enough room for that, so you'd ha I'd have to make a kind of weird modified version. And I think I'm going to bail on this build for right now, and then... Uh, Wait until I get some comments on it from you guys what you think I should do. Whether I should, uh, you know, keep going and just not worry and try to modify it around the, the perimeter edge there. Because there's nothing that says, you know, I couldn't build it into the wall. That's, that's not a problem. And it would still be, you know, access from this side and this side over here without a problem. Uh, the other option, too, is I just get rid of... You know, I don't really need that much seating, so I could probably get rid of this upper level of seating, or just make it stop like one row back, and then that would mean I could build my wall on top of this, uh, and then have like a two wide pathway or something, and not have to make it come this far out. Or I could turn it into a barracks. I plan on having a barracks anyway. Uh, it'll probably be attached to a wall someplace. I think I'm going to. Build it over here, though, where the... Um, I feel like I'm... My headset's got, like, this thing that vibrates every once in a while. I think that's probably when you guys are hearing the that horrible feedback sound. I don't know if they're just because they're cheap and I dropped them or something and now something's loose or... What's going on? Uh, it seemed like it was fixed when I was recording earlier, testing it, so... Hopefully it sounds okay now, but uh, anyway, in this area over here, I think it'll be a more military area because it's close to the keep, it's close to the main entrance of the keep, and there's not a lot of space, so it'd be good to have, like, you know, this chunk right here could be the 
the area where they spar because it would be set up as an arena and then like all around here built into the wall could be the um, the housing you know for the barracks for the people and then I'll probably have like a little archery range I don't know whether I'll make that part of the um, combat area as well I, I just I'm worried about the you know like people might shoot each other and just go nuts but I suppose if you aren't in this little arena portion and I'm not even sure how they work either like arenas they may be set up to where you have to activate them and and you know it's not really what I'm looking for maybe I'll just detach this aspect this aspect this portion of the of the town may just end up becoming wilderness again and I'll just use region to keep it from getting destroyed and that's that could be where I move it instead but uh, I think like I said I'm gonna go to building a blacksmith or something else and I'll just leave this thing here for now and collect some comments from you guys so if you haven't commented yet please do so it's really gonna help me because I just don't know what to do I mean I'm leaning towards getting rid of it but at the same time Oh, that looks bad. I just, I really don't know what to do about it because it's kind of cool and it's kind of not. So let me know and hopefully you got something out of this episode other than me just ranting and being stupid. So uh, anyway, uh, I'm sorry about this episode being kind of lame, but the next couple of ones I, I hope to have, you know, like housing or blacksmith shop or something and it'll be a lot more interesting. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching.